Hey everybody, so today we want to talk about negative accounts. When starting the home buying process, you want to identify what are your negative accounts. Your negative accounts are the accounts that are going to cause you to probably get denied for the home buying process. When it comes to your credit report, you want to get an accurate copy of your report. When I say accurate copy, a report that's within the last 30 days. You want to go through your report and first you want to look for late payments. Do you have any late payments within the last 12 months on your credit report? The next negative item you want to look for are high utilization credit card balances. If you have a balance that is very close or even over your established limit, that's a negative account. The third account you want to look for are collections. Collections will hurt you. Ideally, you want to have $2,000 or less in combined collections. The fourth negative account you want to look for are charge-offs. Do you have any charge-offs listed on your credit report? Charge-offs with a balance will hurt you. You cannot have a charge-off with a balance. That balance has to be satisfied or the account removed in order to move forward. The fifth account you want to look for are liens. Do you have any judgments? Do you have tax liens? All of those will get you denied. You want to make sure the only lien that is acceptable is a tax lien. And if you have a tax lien and you have made three or more payments, you just need to show proof and you should be able to move forward with the home buying process with that tax lien. The sixth negative account you want to look for are bankruptcies. Do you have a bankruptcy that's less than two years old and has not been discharged? If it has not been discharged, then you cannot move forward with the home bond process. However, a chapter 13 is a repayment plan type of bankruptcy. If you have a chapter 13, you've been in it for at least one year. All you need to do is get an approval from your trustee and you're able to actually purchase a home with a bankruptcy. The chapter seven bankruptcy, you cannot purchase a home you have to have it discharged at least two years in order to move forward with the home buying process. And then the last one negative account is a foreclosure. If you have a foreclosure on your credit report and it's also been over two years, then you're able to move forward with the home buying process. But with any and all of these negative accounts, what I highly recommend if you can do a round of disputes and see what you can get removed or credit cards, what you can pay down below 10%. All of this working together will help you to begin the home buying process and to improve your approval odds when it comes to getting pre-approved to buy your home loan. So if this has been helpful to you, give me a thumbs up and I'll see you in the next video.